Now, today's top stories and Power of Five weather from News 5, sponsored by Akron Children's Hospital. Good morning, everyone. I'm Homa Bash. Here's a look at your top local stories. Hours after a U.S. Supreme Court ruling gave each state the ability to make its own decision about abortion access, Ohio put the heartbeat bill into law. The bill has been stalled in the court since 2019. Governor Mike DeWine signed an executive order late last night, permitting the Ohio Department of Health to adopt it immediately. The bill bans abortion at six weeks after conception when a fetal heartbeat is detected. There will be no exceptions for rape or incest, but there are exceptions to save the life of the pregnant person. Violators would be guilty of a felony in the fifth degree and consequences will be for physicians and providers, not the patients. The bill also doesn't prohibit contraception or birth control. What goes better with food than exercise? Well, the people in Parma think you can't find a better duo than running with pierogies. Today is the 11th annual Parma Run Walk for pierogies happening at Tri-C West Campus. Runners already took off. The top three women and men win the famous pierogi necklace. A celebration of food is happening in Rocky River today. It's the 16th annual Taste of River Fest. You may have forgotten about this since it's been a couple years, but it is back bigger than ever, only happening from 4 to 8 over on Linda Street. And you can take a step back in time while also experiencing another culture, the Ohio Scottish Games and Celtic Festival happening today at the Cuyahoga County Fairgrounds in Berea. It features Highland Games, live music, ancient stone lifting competitions, lots more. Tickets can be bought online or at the gate. All proceeds benefit the Ohio Scottish Arts School at Baldwin Wallace University. Lots going on this weekend, yeah. Katie. I'm not hungry now, too. All that food <laughs> looks amazing. It's beautiful outside. We're going to be warm, a little humid, more clouds throughout the day. Temperatures flirting with 90 in many locations. High pressure moving out. We're bringing in our next system that has a shot for rain, which we are due for. We have a deficiency in rain, especially for the month of June. That's where we're about one inch below normal for the month. Future cast shows us that we're going to have more clouds around. Couple showers possible overnight. Pretty light for the most part, maybe pockets of moderate rainfall. During the afternoon, I'm getting more and more confident that there's going to be about half the viewing area that misses out in the second line of scattered showers and storms. But some of those could be strong or severe. We're going to be monitoring it for the rest of your weekend. Mind that tomorrow's going to be humid and then the cold front moves through and it is much cooler briefly for Monday. Sponsored by Akron Children's Hospital.